Welcome to Countersthorpe Laysland Community College and our Step Up to Secondary Information session for new parents. My name is Catherine Aitchison and I'm Principal of the College. We really are living through the most unusual times at the moment and all having to do things differently than we would previously have done. Our transition programme usually involves lots of face-to-face -face contact for students and parents. Unfortunately, we're having to do things slightly differently this year, but I hope that the information session that we've got for you gives you all the advice and information that you need as your child moves through into secondary school. The information session is led by myself and Mr Thurston, who's Vice Principal at the College, and he leads on transition. Many of you will have already met and seen him through other videos that we've already sent out. We really are looking forward to welcoming students into the college in September or whenever it might be that we are able to welcome students back. In the meantime, stay safe and take care and we'll see you soon. The move from primary to secondary school can be a nervous time for parents as well as students and we know that you'll have lots of questions and some worries. Please be assured that even though we're currently living through some unprecedented times, we are still here to support and answer any questions you have. The journey through secondary school is challenging both academically and on a personal level for students, but our aim is to support our students through five and hopefully seven years in secondary school and all that it brings with it. We have a committed team of leaders, teachers and support staff who will help guide them through. At CLCC, our united aim is to ensure our students develop into the best versions of themselves. We want our students to grow up to be well-rounded young adults who leave here with the skills and confidence they need to move on to the next stage in their lives. Ensuring this happens is a huge responsibility for us, but it's one all the staff here take very seriously. We fully understand that you put your trust in us for the five of the most important years of your child's life. Our core values of the college are simple. They're about respect, resilience and success. We want all of our students to develop into respectful young adults who not only think about themselves, but think about each other. With this in mind, we ask all our students to think about how they can have a mind to be kind. We set clear, high expectations, which are non-negotiable. So for our uniform, for our behaviour and our attendance, we've got very high standards and we expect all students to follow those. We also know that in an ever-changing world, students' resilience and be able to respond to change is really vital. We need them to be ready to move on to the next stage in their lives, but this doesn't just happen. We have to provide them with the opportunities for that to be able to happen. Through our enrichment opportunities, our pastoral support, and the expectation the students undertake a learning journey from the time that they join us, where they focus on leadership, organisation, resilience, initiative, and communication skills, they are able to do this. If we want students to be successful, we have to make learning at the heart of what we do. We've got experienced staff, a differentiated curriculum, so the students of different abilities are studying a curriculum which is appropriate for them. In year seven, we have a nurture group and additional support for students not quite secondary ready, but for those who are fully ready for the challenge, there is an academically challenging curriculum in place. This carries on throughout the college as when students opt for GCSEs, we have differentiated pathways and this leads to A-levels as well. We fully recognise at CLCC that in order for students to be successful, there has to be a combination of a good curriculum in place, good progress tracking, rewards for students, a strong behaviour policy and a good attendance policy in place. We have a wide range and challenging curriculum at CLCC, so students get to experience lots of different subjects. We build into our teaching the opportunity for students to develop a range of skills, in particular those relating to independent thinking, problem solving and resilience. As students move through the school, we track their progress through classwork, homework, formal and informal testing, and you will receive regular progress reports, which explains the progress of your child both academically as well as the levels of effort we are seeing. When students do the right thing, they are rewarded and recognised. We're at this point reviewing our rewards policy to make things better for students when they join us next year. And we'll be providing more information on that as we move through the year. We have a really clear behaviour policy in place, which ties in with our core values. We want our students in the right place at the right time doing the right thing. It sits at the heart of our core value of respect. 
our rules are reasonable and we expect students to follow them. We also know that there's a really strong correlation between success and good attendance, which is why we set our students a target of 100% attendance. Being in school is vital to success. And whilst we know and understand that all students develop illnesses at some time, there must be really good reasons for students not to attend and not to be in school. We're really fortunate to have in place some amazing support structures for our students. From a pastoral perspective, all students will have a form tutor who they have daily contact with. That's further supported by a head of year and a year team leader. In their subjects, they're supported by their subject teacher, heads of department, and we have support staff in place there as well. In addition to this, there are lots of other things the students need support with. So we have in place a business manager, administrative staff who help out on a range of things from buying stationery, telling students how they pay for things or what to do if you simply just don't feel very well. The leadership team of the college oversees all of this and offers support in all of those areas as well. We know, understand and appreciate how important your role as a parent is and we want you to be as involved as you can be. We would encourage you to use all our communication systems and in particular two uh, apps called My Ed and Show My Homework. We will provide training and more information on those at the start of the year. These two things though will give you lots of detailed and important information about your child's progress, attendance, behaviour and rewards information. We would also really encourage that you, if you have any concerns, that you get in touch with the college straight away. I hope that has helped to give you a flavour for the college and our values. As we look towards the future, there's much to be excited about. We've recently joined the Life Multi Academy Trust, are awaiting approval for our planning application for a new block, and we're really proud of what we have achieved this academic year. Your child is going to be part of our journey and will help us to write our future to ensure that we excel in all we do. We're really excited about your child joining us and look forward to seeing them when we return to school. Hello, I'm Mr Thurston. Hopefully you've already seen me in the video that I put out just before half term. These slides are to give you some reassurance explain the tasks sent home and give you parents and carers some more information. The next slide is about our learning journey. That is from the time that you've applied to us to the moment your child leaves us. We'll start with year seven and then go all the way through where you'll be able to see all the opportunities for your sons and daughters before they leave us at the end of year 11, or like most of our students, at the end of year 13. As I explained in the pack you should have received, we've provided your child with some really important transition work. Why do we do this? Well, we want to maintain good study habits. We don't want to lose any time. And we know that students who complete the work make better progress, and it's not that much. The reading tasks. Students and some parents often think that reading is something that happens at primary school and then stops at secondary school. This is not true. In fact, for next year, a section of the college planner is dedicated to monitoring your child's reading. and You will be asked to sign to say that they have done so. This work of reading five novels and two articles has been designed with leadership from three of our local primary schools and should not be a problem. Maths is also incredibly important. Rapid recall of times tables can save a student at least 10 minutes in their GCSE maths and science exams. The next two slides are videos. You'll have to click play to make them work. Show how the Pixels times table and Pixel maths app work. 
The first video is my son playing a times table racing game. And the second is me doing some big mass calculations in real time. See if you can beat me. By the way, I'm not a math teacher. Good luck everyone. The Be Awesome Go Big booklet is designed to help children become emotionally ready for secondary school. The PowerPoints and videos can be found in the transition section of our website, but you can do many of these activities without watching the PowerPoint or videos. At the end of the Be Awesome Go Big booklet, there are various challenges. I would love you to start sending in pictures and videos of you undertaking these challenges. Good luck everyone. Finally, to you parents and carers. Firstly, thank you so much for your support so far. It really is appreciated. Please read through the documentation. There's a pack especially for you as well. Could I remind you to return the data and consent forms to us by the 19th of June? Thank you. And finally, the best means of contacting us at the moment is probably via email at transition at clcc.college. Hopefully I'll see you soon. You will be hearing and seeing me in the next video, hopefully out next week. Take care and bye-bye for now.